hello my beautiful cappuccinos and welcome to your love reading today we're going to see what is coming towards you in love thank you for all your likes shares comments and subscribes i really appreciate you guys if any of you would like to book a personal reading to purchase anything or to make a donation to support the channel all info on how to do so is in the description box below um please remember the energies in the readings can go vice versa okay so only take what you feel resonates feel free to switch the genders switch the roles do what you got to do and leave the rest so this is for my beautiful cappuccinos so what is coming towards you guys in love okay so we have the love letter that wanted to come out which reads love notes poetic expressions and messages followed by the sweethearts which reads chivalry consideration and romantic gestures okay and at the bottom of the deck we have the reflection which reads self-love introspection and mirroring so i feel like there is somebody that is thinking about doing something considerate chivalrous romantic for you somebody could be thinking about literally writing you a love letter or this is you okay i feel like somebody has really been watching you and they have been reflecting on a lot they've been reflecting on all the beautiful things you've done for them in the relationship and somebody just wants to show you how much they appreciate you now for some of you if this is an ex I feel like they want to reach out to you, but they know that they can't just say, oh, hey, or I miss you or something like that. Somebody kind of needs to, I want to say pour their heart out, but I, I just feel like somebody really wants to kind of um, romance you in some type of way, okay? They want to do something heartfelt. They want to say something heartfelt is kind of what I'm getting. Okay. Because I see someone like looking at you here or... You know, maybe you're mirroring someone's behavior back to them or somebody's just reflecting. They're just like, you know what? Capricorn is a beautiful person. I feel like someone sees you as their sweetheart. So I'm just getting somebody's either going to say something really romantic or they want to do something really romantic. Okay. So let's see where this is going. I just heard, I love you. 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 So I feel like someone can't tell you enough uh, how much they love you. Okay. So this is for my beautiful cappuccinos. Yeah, we have the student here. It reads, um, learning classes, college, observant, listening and study. Somebody could be at college, they could be studying something or this is you, but I feel like somebody's studying you. Someone also could be studying your handwriting. I just heard that. Somebody may have really pretty handwriting. Or someone could be practicing, like, trying to write in a beautiful way to kind of capture your attention. I feel like somebody's really into, like, words and letters and the way that they curve and all sorts of things, okay? But somebody's watching you. This could be somebody also that you are in class with. Maybe there's somebody that you're crushing on and you're just watching them, okay? You may meet someone at college, university. This could have been somebody who you went to college with. Or this is just somebody who um, learns a lot from you. I'm getting like many different stories here. But somebody, they've been observing you. They've been watching you. They're trying to figure out what to say. Okay, we have gifts. It says material or spiritual gifts, magics, presents, and love. Yeah, somebody wants to give you a present. I feel like somebody feels like you are a very gifted person. I see somebody watching you on a device here. So some of you could be readers. Maybe somebody's watching you read. And they love that because, yeah, like somebody's watching somebody here on a screen, but she can only see herself. Like, it's like me right now. I mean, technically, I can't even see myself because the camera's the other way. We're not even going to get into it, okay? But um, I had to fix my front camera. But, um, you know, when normally when we're recording ourselves, we only see ourselves, but we don't see who's watching us. So I kind of feel like this could be like you if you are a reader or something. It's like you're recording yourself online and you have no idea that someone is like sitting down and like watching everything you're posting okay or somebody had to look into the mirror when it came to you or a situation but either way someone feels like you are really gifted or if you're not a reader or anything like that somebody just wants to give you a gift so somebody could be studying you because they're trying to figure out what it is that you like okay okay we have sadness it reads hurt betrayal emotional sensitive and honoring your feelings so okay this is somebody that lost you clearly so they want to make it up to you someone feels like they lost out on on their sweetheart for others of you this could be too interesting you could be focused on somebody right now you've got your eye on someone but somebody from the past is like just feeling some type of way 
I choose them. It's at the bottom of the deck. It says third party player, indecisive and disloyal. Yeah. Somebody, yeah, and then the teacher, I'm telling you, somebody, I feel like you taught somebody lessons. Somebody chose the wrong one. This is somebody who was either indecisive, they were in and out, they were a player, or this somebody tried to play you. I'm getting the player got played. <laughs> okay. I mean, that's what it's looking like to me. And now they feel sad. It's almost like they're like, oh, what have I done? Or somebody's reflecting on all the times that they played you or they cheated or they lied or something. This could have been like somebody who's like in the public's eye. They have a lot of groupies. They have a lot of fans. They have a lot of people throwing themselves at them. But somebody chose wrong. Somebody didn't choose the right person. Okay. Well, I mean, I don't know what to tell you about that. But let's just get into the reading. Okay. So this is for my beautiful... Who am I reading for? Cappuccino. It's for my beautiful cappuccino. I almost forgot. <laughs> it's for my beautiful cappuccinos. Okay, please carve by the love letter and student. Yeah, someone's watching you at work. The Eight of Pentacles. I feel like you've really been working on yourself. Somebody can see that because, you know, the introspection card does say self-love. So someone is literally watching you at work. Or they're watching things work out for you. I also feel like this person is trying to focus on work, but when they focus on work, they think about you. This is also somebody who wants to work something out. Yeah, the three of swords is at the bottom of the deck. So it could be done with a Virgo or a Libra. You could have those significant placements. Somebody was also trying to work you. They were trying to play you. They broke their heart trying to break yours. So it's definitely a third party situation here. Yeah, and this person wants to apologize with the Page of Cups. Could be done with a Scorpio, Pisces or a Cancer, but somebody wants to apologize okay but with this measly measly little offer the the page of cups i mean yeah the seven of pentacles i feel like you are investing in yourself right now you're not focused on this person at all could be done with a taurus but somebody can see how you're blossoming really beautifully someone can see this somebody feel wishes that they invested in you because you're solid you know from the seven to the eight of pentacles um somebody chose the wrong one You were like the real deal that was like presented to this person. But somebody likes, somebody, this is somebody who just gets um any little pussy or Willy Wonka that comes their way. They just, you know what I mean? They like to um wonder. Okay, sorry. My bestie's messaging me. My bestie, she's a scientist. But anyway, we're not going to get into that. But anyway, let's just move on. Let's be yeah, but somebody didn't invest in you. Okay? So I feel like they can see that you're investing in yourself. I feel like you were very patient. You were very loving. You were very loyal. So, I mean, that's just what it is. Okay? So let's just clarify, let's clarify the page, sorry, because I just got so sidetracked there. I'm so sorry, guys. Yeah, so that, that just goes into what I was saying. This could be somebody who gets sidetracked by things, okay? They get like any, you know what I mean? They can't focus, they can't keep their focus on you, but now, now, you're not, now they're sad without you. I feel like whoever this person invested in, maybe somebody took them for all they had or... You know, it's kind of like someone only likes someone because they were in the, in the spotlight or something. I don't know what's going on here. Yeah, we have the magician. Somebody played too many games. Somebody was very manipulative. This could have been somebody who was doing work on you. So they want to apologize for this. They want to apologize for being a manipulator. The player done played themselves. Yeah, the two of swords. But I feel like you ain't having it. Okay, I don't know who's... Pick whatever sign you're on, darling. The two of swords and the seven of wealth. Or the seven of pentacles you're completely ignoring someone and focusing on yourself they can see this or they don't know what to do yeah they made a terrible decision this could have been somebody who had a lot of money as well with the the, the, the um the um nine of pentacles here but i see somebody single and independent and this would be your energy all earth energy here i mean i'm not seeing capricorn but you know this could be you we got all earth energy here but specifically a Virgo, somebody could have double Virgo placements or a Taurus. 
but i feel like you're single you look beautiful somebody's looking at your pictures but this is like i said this is this is somebody who gets sidetracked by like a pretty face or something they don't know what they have until it's gone i feel like now you're gone and now somebody's just forced to kind of just stare at you and think about the decisions that they made you know people would do anything or ruin a good thing for a bit of fucking pussy it's really sad okay yeah it's really sad <laughs> So I feel like somebody feels like a jam fool, and so they should. Okay, love magic. You're going to be mine whether you like it or not. I'm telling you, this is somebody who was doing magic on you, or this is what they're trying to do. I feel like this person is desperate, so they're trying to do anything that they can. But I feel like this is what this person does. They put these love spells on people to get them all infatuated with them, but it's finally caught up with them. I feel like they fucked with the wrong one, but somebody's trying to do... Yeah, I'm trying to keep it cool. But I get real hot whenever I see you. So I feel like somebody's like, you get someone heated whenever they, like, you trigger this person when they see you. And I also feel like you are gorgeous. It's like you're looking back like, oh my goodness, is that is that who I used to be with? This is true love. This is why this person is so distraught because I feel like the divine sent this person true love. Whether this is you that was sent to somebody or somebody was sent to you. This was a true partnership here. And somebody wanted to play around with some hoes or do some dumb shit. And so we're just going to stalk and not talk. So I feel like you're watching this person. This person is watching you. Or maybe they think that you're watching them. And like, I ain't fucking watching you. But either way, there's not there's silence here. I feel like you don't have anything to say to this person. Somebody hurt you. And that's just what it is. And I feel like this person wants to talk to you. But they don't know what to say. They're just literally sitting in their guilt. This is the year of eight. I keep telling people. Last year was the seven. The year of lessons. Today is the year of karma. It's like somebody didn't believe in karma here or they thought that they were above it. Maybe they had certain placements like Saturn and Libra or you. This could be you because you're ruled by Saturn. I feel like somebody thought they could get away with something. But <laughs> yeah, we have self-abundant. This is what this person can see that you are self-abundant. You are working on yourself. You are fine without this person. You can hold yourself if you know what I mean. <laughs> somebody may have a beautiful pair of titties. Okay, but yeah, you're self-efficient and self-abundant. You didn't need this person. This person needed you. And that's just what it is, okay? Yeah, karmic cycles. I just said that. This is the year of karma. The, lesson, the, the cycle will continue until the lesson is learned. I feel like this person is, is going for a cycle of terrible events i feel like if they do fall in love with someone it's just going to be a hoe or hoes are going to keep because this is what this person focuses on this, this is what it says i choose them or someone made the wrong choice yeah twin flame so this could have been a twin flame connection maybe you were doing that runner chaser thing you're just like i'm not doing the runner chaser thing anymore you just stop the chase you stop the game somebody's caught up Yes, I'm jealous. Yes, I am possessive. And isn't that crazy? Because it's always the players that be jealous and possessive over you, but they're the ones that are playing around. That is just ridiculous to me. Shit don't make no sense. I feel like this person that you're dealing with, they don't make any sense. I was going to say something, but you know, this person is hurting enough, so let's not embarrass them. It says, did you put a spell on me? I can't get you out of my mind. Yeah, this is on top of the magician card. So like I said, this person was dabbing about in magic and now it's backfired on them. Now they can't stop thinking about you. And I think we should end it like I am done for real. Exactly. That's what I'm getting. I feel like for some of you, you don't want this person back. You don't want this liar, this cheat. Are you just, I feel like you can't trust someone. You can't trust someone like they had their chance with you and they fucked up. I feel like you gave this person many chances. You could have been dealing with this person for like several years, several months. Okay, sorry, my chain is stuck on my thing. I feel like you invested a lot of time in this relationship with this person and you don't want to do it anymore. Um, I can't explain how I feel about you. Yeah, I feel like, because this, this is the mutual energy. So I feel like you can't even explain how you feel, but you know you feel some type of way. And this other person, they can't explain how they feel. 
I feel like they can't explain what the fuck they did. It's like, I'm, I'm just seeing somebody sitting here like, what did I do? Yeah, and I don't feel good enough for you. Yeah, so I feel like this is why, because yeah, players, they're very insecure. So this is why they um they have to talk to multiple people at a time. It's like they continuously need their ego fed. It's like an abandonment issue thing. So I feel like this person didn't feel good enough for you. So they would play around and play games. And people who have to play in g games and magic and to force you to be with them, that's somebody who feels insecure. They feel like you're going to run away when you find out who their true character is rather than them just changing themselves. So this person, this is why they did this because they didn't feel good enough for you. But they probably projected onto you and made you feel like you weren't good enough for them. Now this person has met their own demise. And yeah, I stalk you. So who did we get? Um, Libra got, I'm stalking you. So you could be dealing with the Libra. We do have Libra at the bottom of the deck. So I was going to just stalk and not talk and I stalk you. This person, they will watch you continuously. I feel like this is this person's karma to be stuck watching you because they were trying to use some type of magic or some type of, some type of energy to get you stuck to them. Now they're stuck to you and that's just what it is okay but thank you so much i hope you guys enjoyed the reading please don't hesitate to like share comment and subscribe bye